My days in the studio usually begin pretty early. I head out there first thing uh, before I've had coffee or checked my emails, and I turn the lights on, and I sort of look around and take stock at whatever was on my easel or on my wall from the night before. Uh, in in just sort of a split second, I can tell if the uh, painting is working or not, uh, whether it's going in the right direction. Um, it's a really uh, gut reaction, uh, a real honest impression of what's happening. And if I listen to that, I usually get enough information about how to proceed. The work I gravitate towards is probably described as being abstract, uh, but to me it still feels representational. It represents a moment, a sound, a smell, a memory, an emotion, uh, and it's not that I try to intentionally incorporate or recreate those elements visually, but it's more like they appear and direct the progress or process of the painting. One of the qualities that interests me the most is that of movement, of motion or momentum. Suspending a moment so that it verges on both becoming and dissolving allows me to hold it briefly and then let it go before it becomes fully formed or a concrete experience. As the painting begins to be resolved, it takes on a feeling of familiarity. Um, it's a sense that I suddenly recognize it, and it begins to come into focus. 